been a long time. Heck, I haven't even uploaded the stuff that needs to go up tomorrow. Which includes this. Thank you. I can't believe I'm thanking these people. For staggering your way through Aperture Science's propulsion gel testing, you've made some real contributions to society for a change, and for that, humanity is grateful. If you had any belongings, please pick them up now. We don't want old newspapers and sticks cluttering up the building. For many of you, I realize $60 is an unprecedented windfall, so don't go spending it all on, I don't know, Carolyn, what do these people buy? Tattered hats? Beard dirt? Okay, and boop, boop. Do 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 do. Hmm, gamma. Gamma. What have we got Carolyn, in Gamma? Carolyn, Carolyn, why do I know this woman? Did I kill her? Or... Oh my god. Look, you're doing a great job. Can you handle things for yourself for a while? I need to think. Huh. She... Complimented me. What is this? New white gel. Sorry, I got us crushed. So yes, the white gel, it allows you to basically portal onto anything. It is a great gel, the best gel. And boing. Boom. I hate that I keep getting launched out of that whenever I do something like that.
So we gotta go right there. Hmm. How do we get up here? Once again, simple solution that I'm probably overthinking. Or maybe not. Maybe I am. Hold on. Yeah, I am. I think I just trapped myself. Hey, I didn't die. Now, how can I... Okay, so I can jump off. But there's no floor. Unless... Aha! I was overthinking it. Now, hold on, I'm gonna center this down. Okay. Now it's time to zoom, zoom, zoom! Welcome to the Enrichment Center. Since making test participation mandatory for all employees, the quality of our test subjects has risen dramatically. Employee retention, however, has not. <coughs> As a result, you may have heard we're gonna phase out human testing. There's still a few things left to wrap up, though. And the bean counters told me we literally could not afford to buy $7 worth of moon rocks, much less 70 million. Bought them anyway. Ground them up, mixed them into a gel. And guess what? Ground up moon rocks are pure poison. I am deathly ill. Still, it turns out they're a great portal conductor. So now, we're gonna see if jumping in and out of these new portals can somehow leach the lunar poison out of a man's bloodstream. When life gives you lemons, make lemonade. <coughs> Let's all stay positive and do some science. That said, I would really appreciate it if you could test as fast as possible. Carolyn, please bring me more pain pills. Oh no. Okay. Hmm. There we go. There's the button. And bada boop. So, let's go on to the next phase of testing. I should really check my phone. Because it looks like something on Discord. Oh well. Hmm. Can I 
go this way. Okay, it can't go back down. Exits up there. Okay, portal right there. Now... Where do I send other portal? Climbing on up. Let's see if we can get that little small gap. other way. No, oh, portal. Stop. Gotta get up there. Not that way. I wanted you to face that way. But I guess not. Okay. Wall climb in.
Okay. I think we're set. Okay. There. Right there. Yeah, see, because I got to get up there. There. Right there. Down we go. And over. Right, there we are. Thinking. When life gives you lemons, don't make lemonade. Yeah. Make life take the lemons back. Yeah. Get mad. Yeah. I don't want your damn lemons. What am I supposed to do with these? Yeah, take the lemons. Demand to see life's manager. Yeah. Make life rue the day it thought it could give Cave Johnson lemons. Do you know who I am? I'm the man who's gonna burn your house down with the lemon. I'm gonna get my engineers to invent a combustible lemon that burns your house down. <laughs> the point is, if we can store music on a compact disc, why can't we store a man's intelligence and personality on one? So I have the engineers figuring that out now. Brain mapping, artificial intelligence. We should have been working on it 30 years ago. And I will say this, and I'm gonna say it on tape so everybody hears it a hundred times a day. If I die before you people can pour me into a computer, I want Carolyn to run this place. <laughs> now she'll argue, she'll say she can't. She's modest like that, but you make her. <laughs> Hell, put her in my computer. I don't care. All right, test's over. <coughs> you can head on back to your desk. Goodbye, sir. Well. Thank you for volunteering. What does it say? Please use your desk and wait for further opportunities. So there we go. Oh boy, this is going to take a while. Anything in this lab? Nope. Oh, that explains why. Okay, and boop. There's the elevator to the surface. Well, that's a shame. It's stuck.
Okay, down we go. Okay. And there we go. So ends Cave Johnson. One of the best characters to come out of Portal 2. Portal 2's minimal characters all are great. I know things look bleak, but that crazy man down there was right. Let's not take these lemons. We are going to march right back upstairs and make him put me back in my body. And he'll probably kill us because he's incredibly powerful and I have no plan. Well, I'm not going to lie to you. The odds are a million to one and that's with some generous rounding. Still though, let's get mad. If we're going to explode, let's at least explode with some dignity. Okay, now, how can I get... Okay, gotta figure out how to get up. We need to use something. That something might be that. You know what, though? It actually is getting late, and I need to end it off. So anyway, guys, I'm going to end it off right here. This has been Neuronium. I'm going to finish up this game in one more session, but you're obviously going to be having a whole lot more episodes than this. So see you all next time. Bye. Hey, thanks for watching. If you want to check out how our adventures in Aperture Science began, check the top link for a playthrough of Portal Still Alive. And if you want to see me be a monster in a completely different game, check out the bottom link for a playthrough of Rollercoaster Tycoon.